hi welcome back to my channel today we will see another video under amazon machine learning we will see today about amazon recognition so this is one of the services that is being provided by aws so we will see how does it work and we will see a little bit hands-on as well as the benefits of using this aws recognition so it identifies basically uh, whatever our business needs and we can also define our custom labels objects as well as the scenes and collect the images and we will provide to the aws recognition and then after uploading those pictures and all it will evaluate those pictures as per its custom model and get suggestions also for it and even uh, we can train also we can create our own custom models also and it will automatically select the best machine learning algorithms in order to learn from the images amazon recognition custom labels also we can have our own uh, apis so we can analyze those things and give the feedback on our model predictions and we can also use it to retrain it for better performance so what are the benefits it accurately measures the brand coverage so it will give you a report on brand coverage by creating a custom model specifically trained to find client logos and products so it, it makes it quite easy to calculate the impressions instead of like you know trying to follow traditional or social media manually as well as it will find content more easily and it automate automatically generate a list of images clips of some sports images videos and even we can define our own custom trained model to identify all those things and also it improves operational efficiency like training a custom model to automatically classify important objects like any any shapes any objects any fruits any uh, custom sports sports equipments and so on so we will see some hands-on on this AWS recognition. So let's move on to the console. So I will just log into my console over here. I will use my root user. I will just move on to the under machine learning. I'll just move on to the AWS Amazon recognition. So you can see over here, it's not available in this region. So these are the few regions in which it is being supported. So I will choose the Mumbai region. So you can see over here, we have different options over here, custom labels we can define. Uh, we can have the demos for this. And the most important, the newest addition to this is the PPE kit detection over here. We will go through this all. Uh, there are many multiple demos for the object and scene detection, image moderation, facial analysis, celebrity recognition, face comparison, text and image. So even video analysis is also there. So I will just click on this try demo. So you can see by default one image is there 
and you can see the results over here the car 98.8 percent automobile the category basically vehicle transportation so it's giving you all the relative features to that particular image even if i click on the next image you can see over here it's a city town and all so let's try with uploading out my own image over here so uh, let's take one image like this so you can see over here it's a vacation spot tourist person human people and all so these are the options coming over here let's uh, go to the facial analysis so even you can see the demo over here this is a appears to be female uh, look like a face smiling and all so i will upload one of my picture over here so you can see looks like a face appears to be male and you can see that it defines the age range also between 22 to 34 years old so this is how the machine is being trained by the aws for us so just we need to provide the images so depending upon that training it is showing us the features so if you click show more you can see not wearing glasses wearing glasses mouth is open eyes are open does not have a beard even we can try with some normal uh, text in the image we can also try like we can upload some car images and you can see so you can see the text in the image if i go to this uh, object and scene detection and if i upload the same image again you can see it is it is detailing that it's a car automobile and all so we can choose any one of the services like object and scene detection image moderation is there like this we can click and we can make the content blur and all facial analysis then celebrity recognition is also there so you can see so let me upload this one of our indian celebrity over here so you can see it is showing you with us Kapil Sharma match confidence is 100%. So all the famous celebrities can be detected by over here by this facial comparison. Then uh, we have this text and image that I already shown you the latest one that is a PPE detection. Now this is uh, quite important in today's uh, pandemic, you know, this COVID-19 is going on. So it will detect the people those who are wearing the face mask or the gloves a protective kits properly or not so let's try with uh, even if it is if in that capture there are multiple people are there so it can do the analysis for you like you know pe persons with required equipments without equipment nobody is there so this is the person detected over here face detected face cover detected face cover on nose true left hand detected right hand detected so automatically it give you all the details. So you can also choose over here, summarized inputs like uh, P required PPE, face cover, you want it hand cover. You want to check whether the head cover is also there or not. So you can define these three parameters over here, then it will show you the results accordingly. So I will just upload one more picture over here. You can see, I will just upload this one. You can see over here, so you can see face detected, person detected, cover on nose true, left hand detected. So this is how it is required minimum confidence, 80%. You can also define that how much the closest match it should be. So that is a minimum confidence. So if you make it a 50%, so it will just reduce that like a requirement that how much it is matching. So you can also increase it to 95%. So you can see over here, the results. The person without required equipment, there are zero persons over here. So per person results over here coming over here. Similarly, I will upload another one. So you can see over here, I'll just remove this, remove this. So left hand detected, hand cover. So like this, we can have the PPE kit detection over here. 
Similarly, you can see over here, it's a hand cover. Here also, face cover, head cover. So this is how we can use the AWS recognition in order to analyze our pictures and give some results and of the features and all. So later on the series, I will show you how we, uh, whatever the images or, or sorry, uh, the objects that we are saving in the S3 bucket, how to do the analysis on that and how to connect with our own APIs and how we are going to uh, create some applications out of it. So we will discuss uh, later on because in the last video also we discussed about AWS text track. So all together we will see how does we will work with the CLI in order to work on all these things. Even we have this video analysis over here. So you can see over here, uh, people, the celebrities. So there are two people, celebrities, object and activities, what they are doing over here, moderated labels. So even we can download the response as a JSON file in case of this video. So we can choose our own video and we can upload and we can analyze those videos. So the most important thing to uh, know about this machine learning is that, that the training of the machine, the training part of the machine is done by the AWS. Just we need to provide the input and the analysis will be done. Even we can train our own depending upon own uh, inputs. So for that, we have to create uh, custom labels over here. What are the things we want? So that is, uh, we have to define it over here, different use cases and all. Then we can, uh, depending upon the business and all, we can create the use cases. But again, it will create S3 bucket in which we have to provide all the different scenarios. Then only we will be able to work on it. So these things we will discuss in the later stages. So for the time being, just uh, we saw how does this AWS recognition works. So in the upcoming videos, I will try to upload few AWS CLI in which we will discuss how we can access through the CLI S3 bucket, as well as uh, we will discuss about how to use this APIs applications, basically this the services recognition, text extract and all. And moreover, I will try to post some videos on S3 management S3 bucket management also in the upcoming videos. So keep on watching my channel. Please uh, like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.